sky made this one. Baby, you perfect. I give you the word cause you told me your ex was worthless. Pussy nigga don't deserve it. All in my snapping, you surely. Damn, them titties looking perky. Nipples looking like a Hershey. I be damn if that body ain't curvy. So I pull up in the rush. And eat the pussy with no fuss, yeah. I got them on my bus and us, yeah. Disaster strike, I'm busting gush, yeah. Oh, the welcome with the cuts. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Lena Renee. And it's your girl, Tata Kelly. And, and we, we are, are your sexy host, host with In The, the Mix Podcast. podcast. Let's Baby! Go. Hey. Look, we, we got, got here. Who, who we got, Kelly? Joel. We can't leave it with... With his glasses and on, baby. good enough for you. Look, he licking like, the lips. Do no, it again. Of course you can't leave Do out that. the RBN. That's all I'm about to say. Is you RBN. Because you can't check me that way. I just saw the lips and I just said, Joe, hey. I just sure, sure you had it, you know. I mean, my bad. right there. You yeah, 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 look, look, like, look, look. I got it right there, too. But she I just looked at him looking lips. She's trying to give you the shortcut. She's trying to do the nickname. RBN Joel, though. That's my name. RBN Joel, y'all. You heard it first from a man. RBN, he corrected me, man. I seen him lick the lips. And I was like, she said, oh, I got my, she got said I got my LL on. Yeah. And she had it. Oh, <laughs> That's what's up. Man. So, um, anyways, I'm gonna just say it before because I know she gonna say it already. Mm-hmm. AJ ended up telling her something about you singing to me Ooh, on the other yes. interview. Hold on. Oh. So I was like, he wasn't singing to you me. Nasty. He was singing with me. Right, yeah, like, yeah, it like it wasn't like it wasn't like that. Too. Please, I like it. Please confirm for him. Yeah, it wasn't I, like I was that just, before we even get real deep. I was just deep. singing. I was just singing. For what you want? Nah, nah what you were singing though? Uh, I'm just saying. I was singing. Whoever wanted to hear. Nah, man. what you? I want to know what like you was. made a song for me. Like she AJ made like you made. I'm like AJ, look, AJ was not said you were nasty. I'm just saying we made a good song for the ladies, man. Man, for everybody, not me. It's called Cookie. Cookie. We got to appreciate the cookie, represent the cookie well. Cookie. Like, you know, yeah. Okay. So what you do like it? to do to the cookie? Oh, uh-huh. man. I can drive home drunk for that. Nah, I'm just That's it. <laughs> Break That's every it. law for that. Oh. Burn on the house, collect the insurance, and run up a check for that cookie. Oh, you right. Lose our respect yeah. for that cookie. Hey. If you run away with that cookie. No rich again, no Julia Roberts, hey, but I'm pretty woman hey. that cookie. Hey. You know what I mean? Just a little hey. something, you know. Because first Whoa. of all, he just said that you just, now nah, I had to be <laughs> saying this time. time. So, baby girl, I had to be in the house when I interviewed him. Okay. <laughs> Listen, so what's been going on with you? Like, what's, what's new with you? Man, it's been a lot, really. I just uh, got done doing a big show. I had a big show out here hey. about two months ago, and... Shut it down. Had a lot of execs in the building, a lot of people in there. So, and then we're also gearing up for the album. And not only that, I also got a new album. I mean, a new single dropping uh, called Fendiana on okay. uh, Friday. Fendiana, hey. that's catchy. So, yeah, I'm busy. I'm busy. A lot Absolutely. Of stuff. Yep. And, and 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 Fendiana, I take it you talk about Fendi, right? The designer in that thing. Actually, I'm talking about a woman. I'm talking about y'all. Actually, you know mm, what I mean. Fen- Fendiana her? is like. What a woman represents. It's mm. the it's the swag of a woman. It's the passion of a woman. It's the gear of a woman. So, I think Fendiana just represents you two ladies right here. So, Absolutely. that's what Fendiana is about. Okay. And what inspired that craft? Your craft. What inspired that song? Well, actually, uh, my boy uh, FBO came up to me and said, mm. "Man, I got a hook," and he just kept, you know, saying Fendiana, Fendiana. I said, "Damn, that shit sound good." So, <laughs> you know, of course, the team came into the studio. We all wrote it together and then uh, came out with a hit. So I was finna say, I know, I know you ain't cheating on me already. Okay, <laughs> oh, Lord, you feel me? Get ya. Talk oh. about Fendiana. I had to ask you what inspired that because I was like, No, nah, hmm. no. Nah, he said know. a woman. He just nah. met you, ain't a Kelly. Man, that's, that's, he just met you. Nah, so you he been son been to me about the cookie, man. We go together. <laughs> listen, what you mean? Listen, yeah, he y'all son go to me. We go together oh. already. This she made it official already. Okay, I'm about to take that Hennessy because I'm trying to figure out how you know. <laughs> she said, take, take that in it. Because at this point, I'm don't concerned. Take the in it. She said, not tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I like y'all. Listen, I like y'all. 
Listen, so <laughs> was it a woman that actually did inspire that song or it was just about women in general? It's just really about women in general. So, you know, we see a lot of women out here getting their own, getting their bag, you know, getting that, getting to the bag, getting their own out here. So for us, it was yeah. just really like, how can we represent women and call them like something different? Like, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? They getting these tags and all that, but. They really Fendiana out here, so they out here working. So you just created a new term, Fendiana. You just created it. You, know you like this is what mm -hmm. I'm gonna call it yeah. right here. It sounds good. Fendiana, aka Listen. Top Notch. You, you know, she up in there. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, what yeah. Fendiana's about. So, what are some of the things that you, you know, you do in your spare time when you're not working on your music? Um, uh, man, I'm a gym guy. I go to the gym a lot. Okay. You know, I like to compete, so I play, like, basketball, football type Let me shit, see so. your muscles. I go ahead, like, flex. Like, ah, Hold on, this side. Ah, this side. Ah, this side. Ah, you hate it. Like, look, like, you hate it. Oh, it's real yeah. right there. Oh, it's real right there. See, I see, I see, I see, I see you going to be a hater. Yeah, so. <laughs> No, I'm a gym yeah, guy. Yeah, I'm a, my bad dog. She just hate her. Let you have that stuff flow naturally. <laughs> when he popped up the right arm, he that means I was supposed to hit that arm. I was supposed to hit that arm. You wasn't supposed to hit the arm yet. You got to wait for him to switch to your side. Uh, man, he got to hit the arm. Uh, uh. Man, how you knew you were going to switch on, over here? I had to let him know. I didn't even say nothing about singing to you. Because then, now I'm singing to me. Because then he's singing to you. Now you just don't know how to act. What about <laughs> hobbies? You like to you like to go on days, you like to go swimming. What you do, man, other than uh, as as I, hobbies, I don't know, man. I just really like I'm like a introvert, man. I'm really a homebody, so I like to just be around my family and chilling for the most part because, you know, in this business, you don't get enough time to spend with them. So, you know, you just got to spend as much time as you possibly can. So I'm a really an introvert, man. I just like to be with the family and whatever barbecue or whatever cookout we got going on, that's where I'm at. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's where Let I'm me at. fix your plate. Ooh, yeah. What you like? My grandma and my mom in there doing something, especially my auntie, man. They out there working, so. Yeah. Okay. What you be eating at the barbecue? Don't tell me you don't like pork. You don't like ribs. Nah, real. I eat everything. Man. Okay, they thank you. Nah, Post, I eat sauce, it. Okay. Give a damn what they ribs, say. Oh, yeah, y'all match perfectly together. Yeah. <laughs> look, look, Lena <laughs> like all the healthy stuff, that. man. Uh, have, huh? I don't eat none of that. Yeah, tater yeah, salad. Need all that. No, I eat some tater salad. Now, you know, look, the, the I can't beans lie, I'm with the disciplined. beef in it. I'm real disciplined during the week. See you over there. The holiday shit. Now, you no, yo, you be right. going off on a holiday. Yeah, I'm hungry right. now. So you take a day to the barbecue. Have you ever been in love? Yeah, I've been in love. How did you know you was in love? Uh, when all I did was really care about if she was okay, despite if we had an argument or not. You know, at the end of the day, I just wanted to make sure she was okay. So, I You think, sure it wasn't lust? Nah, it wasn't lust. Because lust. if she was arguing with you all the time, that might not have been love. She nah, seemed toxic. Nah. Or it, was it your fault? It's, nah, it, some of it was Who my fault. Who fault was it? You know, you got to be a man to step up and say some of it was my fault. Yeah. Know? But at the end of the day, we're, we're still good friends and, you know, we moved on. So but, you don't yeah, like, I think you ain't I, in I love, I was in no love. I ain't, ain't in no love no more, though. That's the only time you've been yeah, in love? Uh, yeah. It's like a solid one time so Solid so, one so, time. So I'm finna get personal. Man, it's hard in these streets. I'm finna get personal, okay? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Look, so what happened then? Why why y'all ain't together? Y'all friends and stuff. Oh, no, no, honestly, honestly I, what uh, happened? Honestly, I came down here, man. I had to pursue my dream. And, oh, uh, so you broke up with her? Nah, nah. <laughs> she just didn't want to follow me for my dream. So I wow. guess she stayed where oh, she was at, and I went up. on and took off where I had to take off. So. Yeah, I would have had to leave. I had to make plans. Of, me, you know? babe. I couldn't, I couldn't have nobody uh, interfering with my goal. And right now, and true I'm, love I'm, understands I'm, yeah, that, right? You got to. So, at the end of the day, I think I'm following my passion. I'm very happy now. So, man, I would have been right there with the sign, just like Young Man. Indiana, go pay. Indiana, go pay. Yeah, babe, keep uh, going. Get that music, <laughs> get that bag, babe. I'm you. you know what you I'm saying? You would have took her with you, uh, with you sounding like I'm that. I'm probably embarrassed. Yeah, yeah. I'm probably yeah, yeah, embarrassed. Yeah. Hey, look, yeah. you gotta yeah. have you gotta have a number one supporter with yeah, you. Yeah, so. out there, if she don't sound like that. Playing the tambourine. You know? 
Woo! I'm all aboard with it. That's country right there. Playing the tambourine. My mama playing yeah. play the tambourine. Got like, that you don't know, put that tam- Right. Exactly. Because <laughs> I, 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 I got a big heart, but I'll embarrass you. I don't care what nobody say because when done we go said home, she embarrassed bang, you. Bang. <laughs> That's me, okay? I like that. I like so, look, that. what, um, I guess since you got some new music dropping, mm-hmm. um, can we expect maybe a mixtape, any collaborations? What you got going? Well, yeah, I actually, um, I got an album coming out, and I also got a, um, a song out. Well, it's coming out actually with, um, my boy, uh, K major, so okay. it's called uh, Fake Love. So we got that coming out eventually. We got Fendiana dropping. I got Cookie out actually right now. So you can go and uh, go on uh, Spotify, iTunes, whatever you got, and download that. But uh, yeah, I'm just working. But the album is coming soon, so we getting that all wrapped up. And I'm actually gonna have my mom and my auntie on one of my songs. So that's Singing? gonna be yeah, that's gonna be very dear what? and special to me. Let what? me find yeah. out your whole family got yeah, talent. Yeah, everybody got it. Okay. Everybody. I need to be on the song, man. <laughs> listen, listen. He, he do not <laughs> want you on this. I need to be mama on the song. He's going to talk about me and You baby. is not okay. qualified at this me point. Me <laughs> Shit, I need y'all to be an intro. Y'all need to be in the intro I, for the R.B. and Joel <laughs> featuring Bae. Okay. <laughs> yes. He said, yo. Y'all. Okay, well, Bae. I share. Come on. Okay. Yeah, you stinchy already. You stinchy. I can tell you stinchy. Man. So, Joel. What's up? What's up? RBN, Joel. See, I got that Ah, right. Okay. I like that. So, what do you feel like is going to, it'll take to like get your career to the next level? Uh, And what's the next level look like for you? Like, because everybody's definition of the next level is different, right? I'm going to be honest. I've seen a lot of levels so far. You know, I've, been doing this for a long time since I was like 11 years old going on tours with like Zane, Genuine, Avant, all kind of guys so I've been seeing it a lot mm-hmm. but right now it's just all about having a strong team around you that's what's going to get you to the next goal mm-hmm. so whoever who's around you and they believe in what you believe in and what you got going on mm-hmm. if you got that team around you you can't lose so Absolutely. that's what I'm glad I got my team with me. So okay, let's go, let's go team. Hey. Let's go team. Let's <laughs> go. You know, these games used to be hyped. Though. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> I was like, I was a cheerleader, hey. dang in there, cheerleader. I used to hey. love that shit. The major rest and all that shit. Yeah. yeah. See, we ain't had nothing. Look, I used to dance, song. man. Nah, not, they went pop locking well, and know. dropping it. <laughs> shit, back back at home. What? I was, all we used to do, man. H and T. Yeah, uh, man. Back down yeah, south. Y'all believe? Yes, yeah. we used to. I believe. Be sure, give us an example. <laughs> Let us see. Baby, listen. The camera don't go that low. I baby. mean, yeah. I'm just saying. Uh, it can okay. take it off the stand. <laughs> Come on. No, no. We Hell want no, an example. No. I ain't no more Hennessy. I ain't finna be falling around this bitch. No, no, no. Okay. It was worth no. the try. Wasn't it, guys? No, it was no, worth not the try, right now. <laughs> it was worth a try. <laughs> so look, what would you say? Because I know I'm a goofball. I like to have fun. Mm-hmm. I like good energy and spirits. Um, what's probably since you've been, you know, you toured, mm-hmm. and what's probably the most funny or embarrassing tour story that you can share with us? Man, it's been some funny ones. I uh. Slipped off the stage one time. Ooh, you know what I mean? man. Had to get back up and keep performing. Had you know? keep it oh, rolling. damn. So, uh, yeah, that's, you know, that's quite embarrassing. You know, cracked on stage, you know. Or when you first starting off and then. What you, what you mean cracked on stage? Like when your like, voice cracked on stage. Oh, you crack, oh. And you hear it. But so you, you singing went to like. Highway. Yeah, it was no music or nothing. And I was. <laughs> you I thinking I could probably hit the crack. I oh, felt bad. Yeah. I was like, damn, I got to redeem myself tomorrow. Yes, I'm you know sure it's I mean? happening to everybody. What, yeah. was, what was the redemption? What did you do to redeem yourself? Shoot, I had to go back out there and do it again. You had to do it the next night. You ain't the second time? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I showed you my sure ass You sure ain't night. cracked the night or the time I was. Oh, you yeah. <laughs> were singing to me. Yeah. That's why. Girl, right, you didn't crack with me the, either, baby. Uh, I just thought crack. I'd let you know. I think I'm a little bit more seasoned now, so I'm good to go now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But turn <laughs> off the lights. Yeah, you know, hey. Right. Lena, that's just and all light a candle. Wow, 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 wow. Hey. Hey. <laughs> yeah. See, me, I would have, boy, listen. 
What you would have did, Kelly? Man, if I would have fell off the stage, I probably would have just laid there. You just start popping. You in the crowd, baby. Yeah, you had to uh, play it off, but you know what? I probably would have just laid there. I, especially depending on how you fell off that stage. Man, I fell off the front of the stage. I would have death dropped. It was the front of the stage. And Ooh. I just act like I was going into the crowd, you know what I mean? But, yeah. Mm, mm, you know, mm, damn. that drop was something serious. I was nervous. Look, they so. noticed that. Yeah, shit, they I noticed, noticed that. My heart did, too, so I was <laughs> I was scared of shit. So. Like, damn, you but thought yeah, you I was made gone. It. I made it. I recovered. They ain't grab okay, you like you the ain't people. get hurt too bad. Nah, nah. They what you talking about? Like how the people lift nah, you up and yeah, hit nah. you with that? They do none of that. Wasn't nobody right there. Nah, this wasn't no rock star <laughs> uh, crowd right there. <laughs> you just hit the hit <laughs> they, the ground. You know they had drinks in their hand. They was like. <laughs> like, okay. Just look at your ass for a moment. Let me this drink. Call keep on singing, guys. Keep on singing, though. Okay, keep on singing. Is you okay? Is you all right, guys? That's how you I was. You gonna owe me a drink in uh, a minute. Uh, they won't uh, waste uh, okay. no time. Okay. You have to owe me a drink. No, but I, you know what I'm saying. You know, you always want to make sure somebody's okay. But man, especially them expensive drinks. Yeah, bruh. I'm like that in the club. I be looking like they bump me. I be like. <laughs> oh, I'm quick to spill it. I mean, like somebody bumped me and I did the whole drink go flying. I be like, Man, thank you. Wiping Baby. it from between my toes and everything else. I'm like, Lord Jesus. I swear. Uh -huh. I was literally like a fly on the wall with all these people, man. It was just so many people I met. I was like. That Learning fly lesson. on the wall, man. Yep. Like being like 15, 18 years old, seeing all that shit, man. It was just, yep. it was just amazing. So. Learning lesson. Man. Oh yeah. You know, oh, yeah. you got experiences and stuff like that, and mm -hmm. um, I guess go ahead, Lena. So, you is there it. anything else that you want to do outside of music? Like, is there anything else that you like are inspired by besides music, or is that oh. just it for you? No, I, I love music. That's like my first passion. You know, I can do that cooking. You know, I can do that, you know, in the shower. Like, that's just what I love to do. But, you know, helping kids, helping the youth, you know, getting projects for youth and the kids out there and stuff like that. And I'm real passionate about sports and stuff like that. So I really want, like, kids to get out there, be mobile because the Internet and all the phones and stuff like that, it's just, it got kids in a different direction nowadays. Mm -hmm. So for me... I just want to get the youth outside again and, you know, have some fun. So yeah, be able to go to the goal. playground, yeah, right? That's like, my nobody goal, goes to the playground outside, anymore. You know, so. Play basketball outside. That is true. Yeah, you know. Like, everybody's just on Facebook and yeah. TikTok. And that is true. But I'm really uh, all about helping people, really. You know, my mom is the same way, so I get it from her and my dad. So, you know what I mean? They were real helpful in the community with the kids and all that and bringing them up and raising them. So, that's yeah. just what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to be on that next level, too. You working with any, like, charities or, um, you know, any foundations that you started to kind of give back? Well, before the pandemic happened, we were actually going up to the children's hospital, donating toys to them and, and singing for them and just having a good time with them, making them feel good. So Absolutely. we were doing that before the pandemic. But every time I go back home, I'm originally from Flint, Michigan. I always show love to the kids and the youth. So, oh. yeah, so we always show love. So mm. work hard out here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How's the water and stuff like that? I, I, it hasn't improved, has it? They say it has, but, you know, it, it's been like that before they even they got lie. to the news. You know how it go, <laughs> man. So, Sums of bitches. You know, but the people in Flint, man, they strong people, so uh -huh. they working through it. They maintaining through it, so they you know how it go. lying on y'all. Okay. You know how they do. You know how so do. I saw that you released a song, but I could be wrong, but I saw that a song that was uh, called New Money. Yeah. That was posted on 47, and that's my what? birthday. So oh, I was just inspired oh, to know I what exactly it was you that know, made that was, you. <laughs> that was the stars aligning right there. I know, that's yeah. what I'm saying. So, what, nah. is, what was up with that song? Yeah, like, New Money was just like an alter ego I had, man. So, you know, I got this side to me, you know, being from Flint, Michigan, south side of Flint, Michigan, you know, a little rough around the edge. Okay. And shit, so. You know, I, I dibbled and dabbled and did some crazy shit in my life, but you know what I mean? Damn. Now I'm good. New yeah, money, damn. new goals. Bit, damn. New money, <laughs> new levels. So, so you got old on. money then, too, then. If yeah. you done dip dab, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, you can say something like that. Yeah, yeah I, I like the money, old money, but I ain't, look, look, the sugar daddies, but I ain't trying to get no sugar, you know? <laughs> look at you. I'm just saying, I ain't trying to get no sugar. Nate, I'm in a bind. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. Hell no. Okay. 
Look, oh I, my I'm God. an asshole. Okay. <laughs> he was funny. Man, so look, um, I know you got the new the new money and mm-hmm. you got your music and you mm-hmm. sing about cookies. Yes, Lord, I love it. Right. Okay, okay, I'm finna be good. Um, this girl. What would you say? Listen. <laughs> Cookies, Lord. I like the cookies. Okay, I like it. Yeah, dip it, milk, dip it in the milk. (laughs) (laughs) So, so let me ask you. Um, what would you say? Top three collaborations that you would like to, you know, top three artists you like to collaborate. I meant, I meant to say, name them. Go. Top three would be Usher. Yeah. uh, Chris Brown. Yeah, and I gotta go with a hip hop artist. I probably have to say like Fabulous, like Fabulous. fabulous? Yeah, I love Fabulous. But no, fabulous? fabulous. I'm just saying, man. Like Fabulous got longevity, man. I like people that Does got that he? longevity. Yeah, yeah. Fabulous got. That I'm longevity. talking about has he came out with any recent music? But that's the thing. It don't have to so be. So how out he gonna collaborate you know? with you if he ain't doing music no, no, no more? Nah, nah, <laughs> no, you fabulous, just gonna nah. jump. I'm not hating. I love Fabulous. I love just Fabulous. Came, he just I, came back out with Mary J. Blige. What you when? mean? Just like last week. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. See, you, you educate me on something. Yeah, I didn't know. Fab out here now. Okay, because like, I'm about to say it's going to be hard for him to collab with me. you. Nah, and he nah. still talking about F-A-B-O. F-A-B-O. No, no, no. no. <laughs> you spelling B champ, baby. Like, hold on. Yeah. Yeah. spelling B champ. Not spelling B champ. No, but I love Fabulous, man. I've been a long time fan of his, man. So that would be like an ultimate goal. That's just like a personal thing for me so and i did you know uh do a song with jim jones back in the day too so yeah I shout out to that. jim jones that's my guy nice. that's a good guy right yeah. there jimmy ain't gonna play with you nah. let me what about in. female female artists female artists i love um uh, her oh i, I really love like her, her. Like, she got like a nice soul That'll be voice. Ari Lennox is nice yeah. too her yeah. is i love her i too. like all of them what about like? janae Iko? Yeah, she's she got so a nice lit. little swag what? too. That's she's what I'm trying to make some albums yeah, like, like her. I really like all these artists. Like a lot of these artists that got that soul about them, I love that. So anytime mm-hmm. you can sing and have that soul about you, we can work. So. Mm-hmm. But see, I like the soul soul artists, the ones that go deep in that gut and be. Mm. Wait a minute, what? The, that, that Jasmine Sullivan and oh, and. and, yeah. and now, Jasmine Sullivan, boy, that lady did she something. Me but chill. she in a whole nother... Ca- I mean, like... She gave me chill. The, uh, everybody we just named is amazing, but yeah. Jasmine Sullivan is more like a vocalist. Yeah, like, we a, talking about some smooth... Just, she's like, she's gold. She Whitney Houston that type. That lady like, inspires me. Like, when I sing, boy, I just instantly think about her. Mm. Yeah. Instantly. <laughs> That lady, that's like Fantasia. You know what I'm saying? When you sing, huh? Baby, I, can, <laughs> I bust the saying? windows out your car. Hey. And no, I didn't mean a broken heart. Go ahead, go ahead. I probably always have these ugly skies. Let's go. But right now, I don't care about that part. Okay. Hey, baby, I ah. will blow. I will tear the roof. Down, uh, God damn it, now, real. hold on, Kelly. Oh, we ain't supposed to be chill. letting... Uh, hey, man, shit, I we, better get it in. Man, shit. look, yeah. that's why I say I need to get on the track. Yeah. Put me on the track, though. Ready, huh? I'm ready. I got I'm ready. you. <laughs> oh, Lord. Nah, so we going to we, love to you. We, like you, like you. we definitely are so happy that you was able to stop by and yeah, interview yeah, with man. us uh, with this beautiful scenery we have yeah, here. It's sure. amazing. I appreciate it. I appreciate um, it. I'm sure you're looking good under these lights. I'm trying. Yeah, I'm trying. so trying. is there anything else you want to share with us before we close out? Uh, nothing too much. Uh, just I appreciate you both just having me on. And, oh, uh, no. I've never really like come down to Atlanta Station too much, so I'm just glad to be around the scenery, the beautiful ladies and stuff like that. And also, Fendiana is dropping this Friday the 27th. Let's go, so. Fendiana. Oh, show your IG. Oh, yeah. Hello. You can catch me on RBN, Joel, at uh, Instagram, anything that you got. I'm on that. So, at RBN, Joel, you can get me. Hey. Well, thank you so mm-hmm. much for joining us again. It's your girl, Lena Renee. I'm hey, here hey. with Tanya Kelly, baby. I'll do anything for the pussy. Girl, I'll put a ring on it. Get down and dirty. Baby, I'm going face down in that pussy.
Oh, oh, oh.